In this lesson, you'll learn how to make an appointment for an existing client. To make an appointment, select the date that you would like to book the appointment for. You can do this by using the Day Navigation button or the Week Navigation button. These buttons provide a quick way to book appointments. Alternatively, you can click on the date in the top left corner of the screen to bring up a calendar and select a specific date. In this example, our client wants to book in a week's time, so I'm going to use the week button. The client would like an appointment with Ryan at 1 o'clock, so I'll click on the 1 o'clock time slot under Ryan. This will bring up the client search screen. On the right hand side, there is a drop down menu which allows you to choose the type of information you would like to search for. You can search for clients using their last name, first name, phone number, club identification, or email. Our client's name is Cheryl Green, so I'm going to leave last name selected and search for Green. Once you select a client's name, you will see the client dashboard appear. The dashboard will display essential information such as their average spend, number of previous cancellations, past appointment details, and future appointments. Click Done to continue. You will then be prompted to select a tag for the appointment. Tags provide extra information about the client at a glance on the appointment book. This indicates whether they are a new client, a salon client, or if they have requested a specific employee. This client has requested an appointment with Ryan, so I'll select the requested tag and click Done. On the service selection screen, a client's name is visible at the top of the service categories. And over to the right, we can see the services that this client has had in the past. You can either select from the previous services, or you can select a new service from the categories on the left. Cheryl would like to have another blow dry, so I'll select from her previous services. If you accidentally click on the wrong service, you can remove that service by clicking on the recycle bin next to it. Click Done to finalise the appointment. You can now see Cheryl's appointment on the appointment book. Now you know how to make an appointment for an existing client. This is an important feature as you'll most likely be using it on a daily basis.